I'll fix him. Charm grinder. Huh? Huh. Well, you know, what I'm wanting to talk to at the moment anyway. Hello there. Please uh, come in. Let me know if you need help finding anything. Glad Clementine's finally lost her obsession with those infernal butterflies. Too close. Oh, yeah. Rebellion. Hello there. Come on in and have a look around. No touching, if you have. Alright, uh, what about the items we've just got? Any of them better than what we have? And those ones aren't. This one is... Sell to you. Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. If I haven't said it before, it's a pleasure doing business with you. I can buy stuff from you too. <laughs> hmm. And these are going up levels each time, so maybe I'll leave them for later to buy. If they're just going to get higher and higher level. Hmm. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Revelio. You're worrying far too much. Nobody's looking at you. Oh, boy. Why did you buy me a second pair? I hate these socks. Novelty socks at that price can't be passed up. Be thankful you have I'd socks. I'd rather have no socks than be dancing like this. You're not dancing. You're exercising. Dancing. <laughs> See? And you'd said the charm's come out in the wash. Have you been having someone so dramatic, just like your father? Anyone would think you had an affliction. Has he been <laughs> cursed? Oh, please, can't we take these socks back to Mr. Hill and get me some when normal ones? When you pay ones? for your own socks, then you get to choose. Until then, oh my God. thrifty and behave, you're starting to cause a scene. Papa, can we really wash charms out of things? Don't be absurd. That woman will say anything to avoid spending a canut. That's child abuse, isn't it? <laughs> um, okay. Um, hmm. Revelio. Hello, Hamora. Revelio. 
Revenio. I now, demi guys. It's outside, that must be. There's so many things in this town I could have got without lock picking as well. I just never really did this full exploring properly. Um, I still don't think I've really done it properly. Locked, and that doesn't even have a lock picking level on it, so maybe that's for a quest. Yeah, I can't destroy it, so it must be for a quest. <clears throat> There's that one. Locked. Oh. I've done enough of this. Um, let's get to do talk to Serena. Rebellion. I know I'm still doing that, I guess, but seeing if I can see, at least see some statues on the way. Yes, yeah, statues in here do, yeah. Revelio. Guess not. All right, Serena. Hello, Serena. I received your owl. How are you? Hello, my friend. Did you ever find Lord Gog? Hey, Misty. I didn't see, <laughs> didn't see you there first. <laughs> um, yeah, it's a pretty good game. Um, are you enjoying it? I'm not sure if you left. Took sense I didn't. Wasn't paying attention at first. Ah, maybe. Um, hmm. Oh, I think I know who that is as well. Yeah, oh, um, <clears throat> yeah, we're working together. I can tell her that, can I? I did. Thank you. In fact, we're working together to try and rein in Ramrock. Are you? Hmm. I suspected you and he would get along. Hmm. Perhaps best I don't know details of your plans. And I shall refrain from telling you to be careful yet again. But I hope you will be. I, of course. Your owl mentioned you're needing my help with something. I do. I thought you might be just the person to do a favour for my friend Dorothy Sprottle in Upper Hogsfield. I've actually met Mrs. Sprottle. I recently spoke with her about her friend Claire Beaumont. She's lovely. Her late husband Aidan was a friend of my father's. In fact, I'd stay with Dot and Aidan the summers I waited tables here as a student. I've seen her a few times since Aidan passed, but the pub's been so busy lately I've not been as attentive as I'd have liked. I wonder if you might pop in and see her. 
She may need some help collecting ingredients for her supply of Wigan World potion. And you could retrieve something of mine in the process. A box, um, full of old letters and such. <laughs> you know what, let me quickly check something. I don't know why these things don't tell me there's when there's someone in the chat. Oh, I don't know. Hmm. I'll message him later. Uh Why does Miss Sprout have Wigan Wells have a Wigan Wells supply? Huh? Isn't that just healing potions? Why would I be asking this? Alright. Why does Whatever. Mrs. Sprottle keep a supply of Wigan Well potion on hand? Dot's a skilled potioneer. She's been supplying traveling vendors with Wigan Well potion. An ordinary precaution that has, unfortunately, become a necessity. What with Ranrock's loyalists disrupting the trade routes. Plus it'd be first aid, you'd think. Regardless, you'd want that. Um, uh, Alright, why did you leave your box of letters with uh, Sprollets? Please you say a name? Why did Mr. and Mrs. Sprottle have your box of letters for all this time? It's one of a few that I had when I was young. Dot found it when she was clearing out a closet. Can't imagine what's in there. Probably terribly theatrical. The ramblings of a teenage witch and her friends. You're welcome to take a peek inside, if you do find it. To be honest, I'd imagine it contains some lovely memories. Try to stop by. I'll try to go and see her when I can. It would mean the world to me, and to Dorothy. Aidan was bringing the box of letters to me when he was taken ill. Doc can tell you where he might have dropped it. Yeah, I'll get right on that. I'll find the hamlet just north of Hogsmeade. Please do give Dot my love. Sure. If it lets me. Certainly less of them about How far away is this? Okay, that's way out of town. World map. Uh, I got okay. I can teleport there. Now, where to find Mrs. Brottle? Hmm. Revelio. Hmm. Let's have a look at that.
Hmm. I must have already had picked up one of them once before somewhere. Hey, I've talked to this person before. <clears throat> Nice to see you again, Mrs. Pottle. Actually, Serona Ryan asked if I'd come and see you. Oh, dear Serona, a gem has been for as long as I've known her. She thought you might need help collecting ingredients for your Wiganwell potion. And she's correct. My darling Aiden used to collect hawk lumps for me. Since he died, my supply has dwindled. I'm sorry for your loss, Mrs. Pottle. Oh, thank you. Love of my life. A bit lost without him. If you wouldn't mind gathering some hawk lumps for me, I'd be happy to compensate you for your time. Yeah, I have some with me. It saves me going to find some again. Um, I don't really know what that is, but I guess it's a herb. Believe it or not, I have some with me. Oh, thank you. How wonderful. The traveling vendors will be thrilled to replenish their stock of Wigan Weld Potion. Mm -hmm. also mentioned that mm -hmm. Mr. I'll probably grow up. Her a box of mm -hmm. when he fell ill. Indeed he was. Mm -hmm. I'd almost forgotten. I stumbled upon it just before Aiden died. He was hoping to go through it with Serona over a butterbeer or two. Uh, those two were always like two bow truckles in a branch. Aiden took ill when he was collecting hawk clumps on his way to see her. He made it home, but I fear he dropped the box in the cavern. The cavern is in the hills just southwest of our hamlet. You can gather hawk clumps and collect the box of letters there. Uh, huh. Um, what was Serona like when she was my age? Serona said she lived with you during the summers when she was at Hogwarts. <laughs> My character's age, I guess. Uh, goodness. Well, she was almost exactly like she is now. Charming, good head on her shoulders, taking care of everyone. I can't tell you the fun we had when she and her friends would visit us during the year, all buzzing about practicing charms. Talented group. Her friend Mirabelle was a genius in the garden, learned it all from her muggle parents, if you can believe it. Is that the teacher, this Mabel? Uh, what's in the box of letters? Do you remember <clears throat> anything about the letters you put in the box? Oh, of course. A few letters from some of her school friends. Some nice memories. I even included a letter Serona had written to me when she was staying with us. Thought she might enjoy reading it. I know when I read writing from my youth, I'm always astonished at how much I've changed and yet remain the same. True. Something to think about, I guess, in some ways. Um, thank you, Mrs. Sprout. Mrs. Sprottle. Thank you. I'll be here if you are able to collect those hawk clumps. I... And the vendors I help would greatly appreciate it. All right, how far away is this cavern? Uh, okay. Already been there? This wasn't on my map. What's this? Um. Oops. That's all of them. Uh, get them out of the way with. 